Good afternoon, guys, and welcome back to Finland. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, or good morning, because James always gets me to say both. Welcome back to Finland. We're out here today with Tacomo testing the new irons, the 101T. Lovely irons. And as you do know, well, you, probably, you might do, you might not do. You if might you're not. coming over from James's channel, there will be a set of these given away if you do watch this video, watch part three over on Tacomo Golf's channel, subscribe to all three channels and comment. 101T, and you got me to do that because you couldn't remember. Right, so are we telling them about the bet or not? You can tell them about the bet, I'll let you in and you'll. We can Basically, guys, it. what happens is the loser spends the night in a jail cell. Yes, you heard that right. You probably saw Chris's thumbnail, you probably saw my video, an actual jail cell. Well, that was active 15 years ago. Five years ago. I five believe. years ago. Only five but you years told us ago. 15, five years ago, people were in there. Right. Right, 180 yards, a little bit downhill, par three. So we're going to play here nearest the pin, which is a famous word because it has to hit the green. Nearest the pin, then we're going to play a bunker shot and then a short-sided chip with the Tacoma wedges. So, seven iron here. Good strike, it's a touch right. Bunker, in there already Chris, waiting for it. So I said we had to hit the green as well. <laughs> oh dear. Is seven enough for me? Seven's enough, so yes. You, you were short right though. And the best thing here is we have come forwards because from the back tees it was 210 metres. Should we admit something Chris? We've bitten off more than we can chew with this golf course. We chose the back tees. Uh, I'm two, we're both two over par, aren't we, for three holes? So. Both two over par. More down to chipping. I'm going six iron, Chris. James going six iron. We've got a multitude of different irons there, which we will get to in later videos. Oof, James got to take the wrapper off. Absolutely fresh. A moment's appreciation for these shafts as well, by the way. The elusive KBS C taper tour. Are they light? No. 120S, right. I've had two only all in ones in two months, have I told you? I don't care and nobody else does, James. All you've got to do is hit the green here to win. It's drawing. Is it going to hold the green? Oh, it's short. It's short. How embarrassing. Right, well, we're not going to have nearest the pin, we're going to have the nearest in two. Are we? Well, that's what most people do when on the golf day. I mean, it's normally par fours where it's nearest in two, not a par three, but that's what we're going to do. Oh, I'm not going to lie, Chris, that felt so good in the air. Mine didn't, well, mine was struck well, but just in the wrong direction. Yours, yours is big with that seven iron, to be fair. And for me, uh, we have to stay off the fairway here, is it? Should we hug the left side? Hug the left, we'll hug the left side. side. We were hidden by the wind there, I think, or from the wind a little bit. And yeah. that's what I'm going to go with. Lovely golf course. Yeah. Fantastic golf course over the ladies European tour event not long ago, I believe. I can't believe you're not going to give me that nearest the pin. I mean, I might have been just short, but I am... Uh... It's not on the green. We, we put the uh, rules and regulations out early. Yeah, you did to be fair. Uh, right, nearest in two then. At least I can put it. That's a very valid point. You're getting your wedge out. Unfortunately, we're going to have to go 60. I'll take this. 60? No. 60 and a night in a jail cell. Not, not a good I'm day. struggling to do that with cold hands. Start at the bottom, mate. You start at the wrong side. Easier to get it from the bottom. It's off. What are you whinging at? Oh, ho, ho, ho. right, Chris. Bunker. Not what dreams are made of. First not bunker one. shot of the day, but at least I'll be ready for the next shot. Of the European trip. Plenty of sand in Aki. Ooh. Not a terrible shot, but certainly not one of your best. I also don't think it's winning there. That could be one down. Oh. Come on! One up. Right, I'll let you select the bunker shot. Uh, I'll probably go from the one you've not just played from. Right. That was a bit of a longer bunker shot. Can we put that down as a par for my score, Chris? 
you want 52? Yeah, I'm going to go 60 Ooh. again, unfortunately. Jump oh, up, oh. steady. You don't want your knee going when you go get up in that top bunk. By the way, well, I haven't thought of this. I haven't thought of this, Chris, and I'm not going to say it too loud so the guys can't hear. If we're half, are we both in? Oh no, we'll, be, <laughs> we'll both, both go in the suite. We both get the suite. Oh, how good is that? That had some lovely check on it as well. Could be a game changer. Right. You've actually played a really good shot there, haven't you? One up to James, this. I'll go oh, two up, actually. Soft sand, isn't it? Very soft. A lot of sand in there. I don't want to put you off, but it's probably the toughest bunker shot. Oh, and as a result... Pressure... Even in flight, I thought that might have released out a little bit. Pressure's got to him. A lot of sand. The hardest bunker shot all tour pros don't like is when there's too much so, sand. So, Chris, how would I play that differently? Have I just taken too much sand? Too much sand there, yes. We either want more speed, more aggressive, or we'd take less loft. There you go. Nice yeah. and aggressive. Bit of check. Always learning, Chris. Level. Always learning. Right, we'll play a bump and run with a 52. Yeah, I'll get this. Here he is. The key, right, the key is push first. Push first. Don't where, drag it into the middle. Where did you learn that? You. There you go. Always learning, James. Tell you what, heart rate's up. <laughs> Always leave it better than you found it. I thought he was going all the way around then. Right, leaders off then, James. 52 degree here. Yeah, a little, little wedge as well, actually. Skyforger 001, 10 degree of bounce. A little rounded leading edge as well, which you don't see on many at the moment. No, sits nicely. I mean, it was a good chip. That for the half. Duff and run. Say what, the boys weren't bothered. I expected a clap or something. Not even a ripple, because they saw the duff as well. That needs to go. Go on. Go on. It's a great shot, and I think in normal circumstances, that gets it you. Yeah. What a duff and run. Right, guys, we're going to go over to part three on Tacomo Golf's channel. Going to finish this off to see who does lose but then also watch out this week we i will be doing a review of these wedges and be giving away a full set of wedges 